job is going to get better as, as the, as the um, months go by. Um, once he gets an offensive game, and, and he's been working on that, he's been really good. You know, Dan, um, you know, that he's gotten a lot of respect from the league and he also has Gabe. So, you know, they're sophomores now, and um, you know, I think they're going to be really good for this team. When, when you take off that jersey for the last time, what are you going to remember the most about your time in Minnesota? Um, just the stamp I made on the community. You know, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a big guy on the youth, so you know, I was able to help the, the youth a lot, the community a lot. So, I mean, that would probably be my biggest take on you know, making the biggest impact I could on the youth. You and Jordan, I mean, you guys are kind of, you guys have been kind of through the thick and thin with everything. Jordan, whenever you look at his numbers, how do you think his legacy will be remembered? I mean, you played side by side with him. It's time to retire his jersey. So, you know, I wouldn't even wait if I was in school. He's, he's done everything in the tomb school. He's in the tomb rebound. So, you know, I just think it's time to retire his jersey. I'm side by side with him. I think he's actually going to do. What he's going to actually do is tremendous. What a coach would say. Just what any coach would say, you know, it's, it's a tough loss, uh, especially, you know, when you, you scratch a call back and then they hit big shots. So um, he just said, um, just talked about, you know, how, how, how good we, we did this season, how we um, proved a lot of people wrong, and you know, the, the team next year should have a lot looking forward to. Do you play the what if game in your head at all? But if Jordan is healthy, if Mott's and Eric had been here, do you, do you play that? No, not at all. You know, you can control what you can control, which is energy and effort. Um, you know, them going down, it, it does play a factor, but you, know, you, can't, you can't play with anything. How tough is it to, to play against Cassius? Uh, yeah, he's tough. Um, you know, big, big, big 10 player of the year um, for a reason. So. Um, you know, we kind of kept it in check for a little bit, but you know, they got other weapons, so, and when they got other weapons, you let you worry about him less, and, and he, he was able to get going. Amir obviously kept you guys in it. Oh, obviously, you guys made a fight there in the second half. What was it? What did it mean just to come back and, and make that one last surge? Um, so we had to play hard, and you know, Amir, Amir was, was one of the you know, vocal leaders, and, and he, he wanted to win. He showed he wanted to win, so. When you look at this team, there's some young guys that can learn a lot from this experience and hopefully take it into next year. What do you hope they they learn from the whole season? Um, just learning that, that, that this hurts. You, know, you want to get back in the same predicament. You want to get back in the second round and be able to just get a good team again. So um, that's, that should be the biggest takeaway from this. Remember this in the back of your head for when you get here next year. Thanks.